Today's creature of the day is the Tiktaalik. Its name is the Nunavut word for large, shallow water fish. A fitting name as it was large, around 2.75 meters or 9 feet long at max, and it did hang out in shallow, fresh water. It was found in Canada and lived around 375 million years ago. It was a type of fishapod, possessing features of both fish and early four-limbed land animals, or tetrapods. Its fish characteristics included scales, gills, thin fin rays for paddling in water, and the fact that it did live mostly in water. Its tetrapod characteristics include a flattened crocodile-like head, robust rib bones, lungs, and a flexible neck that was separate from its shoulder girdle. Its fins had sturdy interior bones and functional wrist joints, which allowed it to prop itself up and use its limbs for support on land. Still, it had fins instead of fingers and toes. It was very important in tetrapod evolution, though it is considered a close relative of the direct ancestors of tetrapods, not the direct ancestor itself. It ate smaller fish and some land animals like invertebrates, one of the likely reasons it came to land. It was hunted by freshwater sharks, and to avoid these predators could have been another reason for its adaptation to land. It went extinct due to environmental changes and competition with large amphibians. It was described by Edward Deichler, Neil Shubin, and Farish Jenkins in 2006. And there's only one known species, Tiktaalik rosea. In media, it's appeared in David Attenborough's Rise of Animals, Your Inner Fish, Great Transitions, The Origin of Tetrapods, Prehistoric Kingdom, Dinosaur Simulator, and the Prehistoric Nature mod in Minecraft. Well, that's an ancient quote-unquote fishapod that people like to blame for their problems quite a lot. Sure, we have bad stuff today, like taxes, pollution, politics, but we are not blaming it on this adorable little fish. Anyways, be sure to like, subscribe, and comment what other creatures I should talk about.